Hello, my dear viewer, you are welcome again to my channel. Well, in this video, we will be looking at how to wire a master switch. All right, so what is a master switch? A master switch is a switch that controls the action of other switches, circuits, or devices. It can be used to turn on or off a group of devices at once or to control the flow of power to a specific area. Master switches are commonly used in electrical wiring, like the example I'm going to show, networking, and other applications where it is necessary to control multiple devices from a single point. There are many different types of master switches, and each of them has its own unique features and functions. All right, so in this video, we will be looking at how to wire a master light switch. All right, so for instance, in this wiring, this lamp is required to be controlled by this switch. And then there is another lamp here, which is supposed to be controlled by this switch. Okay, this at the middle here is now serving as our master switch. So we assume that these two lamps are in separate rooms. So in this room, we have one lamp, and that lamp is controlled from this switch. And then in another room, we have this lamp that is controlled from this switch. And so this circuit is wired in a way that the power supply to the switch that controls this lamp and the power supply to the switch that controls this lamp are all wired through the master switch so that if the master switch is off, you cannot switch on the light. So this light can only come on when the master switch is on. And when the master switch is on, you can either switch it on or switch it off from here. You can also switch it on or switch it off from here. So let's say this is room one. Room one, we have switch one. This is room two. Room two, we have the master switch. And then this is room three. But you want to be able to control these lamps from this master switch, irrespective of whether this switch is on or off, or whether this one is on or off. All right. Let's look at how the wiring is done. All right, so first of all, this is the feed from the supply. And so the feed from the supply will first come to the common terminal of the switch that we have selected to be our master switch. Okay, so here, the feed comes to the common here. For all the switches, I'll be using the common, and then the L2 terminal. Okay, so what next? So, I will need two cables. And what am I doing with those two cables? I will join them together. And so these cables now will serve as supply cables to this switch and then this one. And I'm taking it from L2 of the master switch. So we have feed here, and then I have two wires connected from the L2 terminal of the master switch. One of those will go to the common of this switch. And then the other one will go to the common here. Okay, then the next thing we will do is to connect the switch wires from each of the switches to the lamps. So in this case, we have this switch that will be controlling this lamp. We have this switch that will be controlling this lamp. And then this one will be our master switch. We connect the switch wire from L2 here. Then this switch wire will also be taken from L2 here. 
Okay, our wiring is done, so we can turn our switches. Okay, so we turn them like this. Turn them like this. So now, these two switches are not working because the master switch is off. If the master switch is off, there is no way these lights will come on. With the master switch on, the individual lights in the individual rooms can be operated by their assigned switches. Here you can switch it on and switch it off. All right. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please do well to share and subscribe to stay connected. See you in my next video.